welcome back and for those who are joining me for the first time welcome please feel free to go ahead and hit that red subscribe button and also guys don't forget to turn on the notification it's the bell right beside the subscribe button so you don't miss any of my uploads now if you're interested in this look then please keep watching I'm starting off with a small brush first because I want to keep the colors really low and I want it to be able to make that circular um, look that I'm going for without blending it too much in the lid like I normally um, do my blending so I'm starting off with this Star Crush Mineral um, eyeshadow and this is Wild Strawberry and then I'm going to start right there where my crease is and I want to make sure that I keep it really rounded so I'm just dotting it like in a circle and I'm gonna start to join that circle so now I'm gonna start to really blend out and I'm just taking my time smooth out the edges without bringing it up too far I'm just going to go over that edge so it doesn't look so harsh. Then I'm going to go back in and intensify it some more. Going back in with the clean brush. Now I'm taking another Star Christian Mineral eyeshadow. This is Midnight in Paris. Um, very dark purple. And right in the crease. And try not to go up too high where I cover the paint. Now I'm going back into the pink and I'm just going to blend the pink and the purple so it doesn't look so, just a drastic change. I'm taking my MAC Prolong Wear Concealer and this is in NC42. I'm gonna start cutting the crease. Now before I go ahead and put on my glitter, I'm just gonna use this Duo Eye Eyelash Glue. Before I do my foundation, I'm going to color correct a little bit. I'm using this NYX About and Beyond Full Coverage Concealer. Um, I've had this for a very long time, pretty much hit pan. Um, I like it, but I still prefer the LA Girl um, Concealer in Orange. I just want to finish this off, so that's why I'm going back to it. Now I'm going in with my foundation and this is the MAC NW50. Um, it's a little bit dark for me, but I like to mix it with the BB Cream um, Plus Illuminator from Jared Cosmetics. I'm using the Small Elf Brush. I know it's dirty, but I just used it yesterday, so it's fine. So today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to mix the serum foundation, yes, foundation, with the Prolong Wear Concealer 
for my under eye concealer and see how that turns out I did a review of the serum foundation I'll link it below if you guys haven't seen it and I also did one of the coverage I'll link both of them Now I'm going to finish off the under eye and I want to make sure that the concealer is completely blended out and I'm not going to set it I'm just going to go straight in with the shadows that we use on top we're going to use the same two shadows under the bottom so this is going to set the under eye and also really intensify the color. Now I'm just taking MAC um, nylon. I'm gonna go in the inner corner and a little bit on my brow bone just to highlight it a little. look for my lips I use the Jared's cosmetics this is cocoa beam um, and I just went over it with the lip gel this is from the dollar store guys for my highlight I use um, makeup geek rekindle it's not glittery or chunky or anything you just have a nice glow to it I have a little bit of blush and I use my blush palette from BH cosmetics mix two of these blushes I mix this pink one along with this and I set my face with Jared's cosmetics slay all day and this is green tea and then of course I can't do without my max fix plus so I just went on top of that just to give it um, a more skin like appearance and more dewy and this was also an Instagram inspired look I've been seeing it around Instagram a lot and I really love it and I just wanted to recreate it so let me know how you guys like it and if you're you're gonna also recreate it go ahead and tag me in my Instagram I'll leave it below and all the products will be linked in the description box again guys if you're not subscribed I would love it if you go ahead and hit that red subscribe button and also thumbs up this video for more looks I'll see you guys in my next one
Bye.